Good morning children. In today's class, let us learn about magic hexagons. You know what is an hexagon? Hexagon means it has got six sides. Like that here, along the sides of hexagon, along each side, numbers are written. That is, each side has got two circles and one box. The rule here is, when you multiply the numbers inside the circle, you will get the number which is written inside the box. Say for example, when you multiply the numbers in the circle 10 with 7. 10 into 7, you are getting the number inside the box that is 70. Likewise, 7 into 14, you are getting the answer as 84. 14 into 5, 70. 5 into 13, 65. 13 into 2, 26. 2 into 10, 20. So this is called as magic hexagon. Let us see how to fill the boxes or empty spaces in this magic hexagon. First of all, let us start from this side which has got two circles 6 and 17. When you multiply the numbers 6 and 17, you will get 102. So the number which is it should be written inside the boxes 102. Now let us move on to the next one. The numbers written on the circle 6 and 11. When you multiply 6 into 11 it is 66. So the product 66 must be written here. The next product 11 into 9 it is 99. But when you come here already the box is filled but this uh, circle is empty. That means when you divide 108 by the number 9, you will get this answer. That is 108 divided by 9 is 12. Now you can check. 12 and 9 when you multiply, you are getting the answer 108. Next one is easy. 12 into 7, that is 84. And the next product, 7 into 17, it is 108. 19. We will see one more example like this. Observe this magic hexagon. Let us start from the easy one that is 8 into 8. When you multiply you will get 64. The next one the product is there but the other number is missing. So what you have to do is 104 you divide by 8. When you divide 104 by 8, you are getting the answer as 13. That should be written here. Now you can check 13 into 8, you are getting 104. Same way, the next one, 78 product is there. So you divide 78 by the number 13. You will get the answer as 6. That 6 you can write inside the circle. So 6 into 13, you are getting the answer as 78. The next one, both the circles are there. 6 into 4, 24. We can write the product here, 24. Whereas the next one, the product is there. So 64, you divide by 4. 64 divided by 4 is 16. You can write 16 here. Now we can check 16 into 4, it is 64. Finally, the last one. 16 and 8, if you multiply, you are getting 128. Hope you have understood how to fill the empty spaces in magic hexagon. Thank you children.